Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Whoa Long Fallen Dynasty on the Series JG. Um, so it did a little bit of messing around off screen. I don't think I can. I mean, I think it would be hours and hours and hours of grinding to try to get any of these post game sets to drop. Uh, you'll see now we're dressed up as Yuan Shao. Because I noticed that uh, this armor set doesn't really have a whole lot of uh, complex stuff going on, but it does uh, does give you uh, damage received reduced by 4%, melee attack damage goes up by 12 and uh, I just kind of went in and manually, and, and I didn't have as much flexibility with this as I thought, like... I thought I was going to get all these uh, damage reduction stuff things on the armor, but in fact, I guess there was something going on with the slots and which uh, additives were available uh, that I wasn't completely following, but we kind of got like generically uh, spirit damage boost, I added to our flame attack power, uh, because I did note something where you're, you want to have the cleanse ability. That's not the cleanse ability. You want the cleanse ability because it takes away uh, status element stuff, except for metal, which you can take away with fire. So, I figure we'll be using fire for a little extra damage, but not much. And also, uh, we're going to take one shot at Yuan Shu, and I don't expect to win, because what we're going to do instead with the rest of this video, unless I happen to win is we're going to uh, play some of the other side missions that became available when we beat level 1 and level 2 of the main story of DLC 3. And just really, really hope... Oh, and I uh, fed Don Fu enough cups of cordiality to get him fully leveled up in case that somehow helps. Oh, and here's a here's a thing that you should see. Uh, so I actually also went to... Um, I re-adjusted uh, re, uh, our stats so I could wear this armor, because this is really heavy armor. Um, and this may not have been a good idea at all, but I, I raised our Earth Virtue so we could wear this heavy armor and still have decent evade. And, uh, because this armor, even though it's only, level, it's only leveled up to 8, plus 8 instead of plus 9, these are still have better defensive values than what we had been wearing. Satsau's armor, I think, was better than I realized. It was a high-end heavy armor. And uh, we've got the Soaring Ursine Mace, which we're using because it has a uh, damage boost from uh, Earth Element. And we've got Silver Inlay Dice and a Secondary Night Alcane, because that's giving us one tiny piece of Strategist of the Genius, which is Status Effect Accumulation. It's probably not that useful. I should consider, actually getting rid of that uh, and find something else like the um, there is a uh, there's a Zhou Yu set Soon's Elder Veteran I don't think that's it hold on there's a Zhou Yu set we might want to do instead of this uh, Stratus of Genius set Kind of depends on, uh, Dizzy Flu. This one might be just, just 30 extra hit points might be good, actually. Because we could do that. How many hit points have we got? How much of a difference is 30 going to make? A thousand hit points. 30 is... But that's not making a difference. Okay. All right, but we will we will take one crack at Yuan Shu uh, just to see how we're gonna do now because I don't think this has made a difference. I I went and I I, I took I, I actually fought Yuan Shu a couple of times to get four tier Yuan Shu armor that I could add like the most just generically decent like you know slightly increased decreased damage we deal uh, take slightly. Increase spirit damage, we deal, etc. And I don't know that it matters at all. With our strength combined, we should... 
victory. The one thing I did change is that our spirit beast now heals uh, our allies. Uh, but I have never gained a good understanding of how the spirit beast meter works and how one would go about um, filling it up. This, maybe this is what it is. That didn't change my meter at all. I'm trying to remember how one even summons that thing. Divine Beast, circle, square plus X, activate Divine Beast, will summon a Divine Beast. Mm -hmm. So we want the Divine Beast Resonation, I think. What I don't understand is what actually builds that ga gauge. Because one strategy that I did see someone mentioning that, that was helpful was uh, switching the Divine Beast, because there's different Divine Beast effects, and we haven't used Divine Beast very much. But there is one Divine Beast resonation that's just like, yeah, it strengthens and heals your allies, and avoiding damage while keeping your allies strong can be handy in this game as well. Yes. Oh, summon it. Strengthens surrounding allies. Okay, so we want it's it's the summoning, not the. Uh, got it. I almost uh, turned that around the wrong way. So summoning is circle plus triangle. Meaning, what I don't understand is how you fill the divine beast meter. <laughs> Battle flag you use, increase the amount of spirit you obtain. Because uh, filling that meter was, uh, I mean, in uh, in Neo it was. The Amrita would also charge up your, you know, occasional use super thingy. Switch creature we had with first third pound at a time when used. Case the effect of all current vengeance. Re recruit or seek reinforcement use as an item. This allows for instant reinforcements. Well, that's true. That's where we're going as far as, like, if I just can't get this shit to work. Alright, whatever. Let's take one crack at this. Oh, the wrong way. Let's take one shot at this before we uh, go see some other stuff. I'd like to see if we can get some level 9 uh, leather and uh, upgrade our Wapit one more time. I didn't actually mean to hit the door there. Oops. 
And it's slightly annoying to have it loading these movies, but if I set the default so that the movies don't play, I'm a little worried we'll miss the movie that we'll eventually play when we eventually win this thing. Okay, so that didn't... No good. Off to a great start here. I evaded game. You trying to do too much. You guys aren't trying to do anything, and it's working great for you. Kind of working. It will keep me alive to stay away from him. That didn't work though. This is Ow. time to be cavalier. Thought I uh. Let's keep targeting. My strength fades. He's doing better than I expected here, actually. I thought I evaded that, but whatever. They're both dying now? Yeah, so this is a strategy that I might want to use more in the second half of the fight, not to the first. Because I'm using all my healing, and I still have to be the first bit. But just learning his attacks is probably... Anyway. Spend half a video on that. I mean, I could try one more time. That was, uh, yeah, that was, uh, I think I just do need to learn how to, like, freaking beat him. Uh, if I could find a reliable way to get level 9 leather, I've got enough to upgrade one of my pieces of gear. I could get to where, because now it's like, I think I got slightly better defense than I did as, uh, in the top side gear, but I re I rearranged my uh, skill points in such a way where I might have slightly less hit points. Um Let's go travel. I think we could try to see if these sub battlefields that we haven't already done might have like one time only uh, the bold, bold and uninhabited tales of nemesis. Let's try uh, this. The once quiet and peaceful waterside village is now infested with demons, devoid of any sign of human life. To rid the area of these monstrosities, you and Guan Yu return to the village. Soon, however, the two of you notice a suspicious figure observing you. 
Do we best to confront this strange man and bring him to justice if he has any ill intentions? What strange man? Yeah, we do want to leave this belt. Because it's kicking our ass. Yeah, I mean, uh, I think I, I think we I think I do need to get good. This is the last boss of the last DLC. Um, it doesn't feel like it's way further out of reach than other bosses that we've eventually beaten. But I, maybe I let it get into my head that uh, I read up on this thing. I think part of the reason I'm not feeling that hopeful is that other bosses kicked my ass, and I finally gave up and read online and found out about an elemental weakness or something that made the fight much more doable after I threw up my hands and, and went and looked it up. Whereas in this one, it really is just like, there's a couple of people with guides about like, you know, here's every single attack and the timing of perfect evades. Uh, and nothing seems to be offering a way to beat it without just getting absurdly good with the game. Other than the strat that was like, I switched my god beast the to the one that will heal my friends, but... Until we eliminated that have taken hold of this place. Uh -huh. And now I can't figure out how to get that to pop more quickly. So the only obvious thing I'm missing that would make this... That would help, although I don't know that it would help much, would be to upgrade my armor. I just kind of hope we'll get some level 9 leather. That's where we came from. Oh, and I don't have marking flag detection anymore. Resentful bandits note. Now that this this didn't do it, this gave us uh, fame. What did fame actually do? Oh, I'm vanquisher of Gan Ning because we beat Gan Ning once without getting hit because uh, the game just like puked in its mouth and uh, he was defeated automatically. Beast bestiary. I'm sorry. I was looking for. I guess it goes to inventory then, doesn't it? Uh, that bastard with the boss dead. Taiping Taoism has come to an end. Now I have no choice but to live the life of a bandit, pillaging and fleeing every day. A man as skilled as me should be doing something more reputable, not living a disgraceful life like this. When will heaven smile upon me? Oh, there is a character in the like in the Dynasty Warriors games who Guan Yu. I think it's Joe Fang, isn't it? There's like somebody. Where the story is supposed to be. Uh, they were like a yellow turban type, but they join up with uh, Guan Yu. And I don't remember it being a huge event in the book, which probably means it did happen in the book, but it's just like a one line thing. And uh, they make a big deal out of it in some of the Kawaii games. Get up there to where he is. This is uh, really annoying. Juan, you figured out a way, so that's nice. This is a pretty good whoppet too, for. Uh... Yeah, I guess I just hit the wrong angle. Large genuine key crystal made with genuine key parts. All right, well, keep an eye out for flags because I don't have my normal flag detection stuff going. I can switch back to South Oh, I just. You it came is your king. You abandoned dwellings? dwellings? You scoundrel. You must be punished for your crimes. Sexy punish. 
All right, well, yeah, so it is Joe King. I wonder if he's going to be like a a guy with gear that you can hang around with or whatever. And, you know, be your bodyguard. You can be your long lost pal. And more importantly, means he has his own out outfit that you can uh, get from him. Thorn Whip is not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for... I don't know, Thorn Whip might be really good, but what I'm looking for is some... Should be like Class 9 Leather. I'm gonna be a Leather Daddy. Ah, sucks. I thought I had evaded. I managed to not only not evade, I even was hanging around when it exploded. Just to look extra dumb. But we found one of them there marking flags. I was trying. Not seeing this uh, level 9 leather that I was hoping for yet. You are cleansed now. That's a large, genuine key Gall. I briefly, briefly, briefly thought that that Guan Yu jumping up behind me. I don't know why. What was going on in the blink of an eye there in the graphics. I thought it was like, oh, a spider was uh, attacking. Oh, it is Guan Yu. And he is uh, walking up behind us. <laughs> jumping up behind us. Fire guy himself. Oh, I like a little damage. Too. I could switch to poison cells. I got poison cells uh, outfit. Not outfit. I mean, it was an honor to witness such a fine display. But, uh, like I'm not, ex I I'm not entitled to level nine uh, gear, but or uh, leather, but. It seems like they don't have any place where you can just get it automatically by beating the same mission over and over. So I really have to hope that these few missions that I haven't beaten once, where the, the initial best possible loots are still available, that I find it. Is, lo is also not leather nine, le level nine armor or uh, uh, leather. Let's see in the inventory. I 
I'm looking for... Like, I'm trying to entertain the idea that maybe I could eventually get one of these sets. This is... This is the subtlety of the metal phase. I think this is the one I want to try to keep. The Dong Zhuo shoulder cap. If I could find, like, footwear that's five stars and has one of the funky post-game, or, uh, new game, uh, beyond the initial difficulty setting, uh, things in it. Doesn't seem like I'm finding any of them once I get down to this end of, uh, upgrade level. Date of obtention, defense, rarity. Is the rarity it? Is the are the fives gonna be up here? I think so. All right. Principle of Ling Bao. Increases HP damage up portion number of negative negative effects on a target. That's not gonna do us any good against him. Dauntless Warrior. Let's get rid of this, uh... Yeah, normally I would like this, but let's get rid of it for now. Let's see what this fellow gives us for in exchange. Better be at least level 5 or I'll be, you know... Annoyed. A large grass knot. I feel like I have a billion of those. And they don't help because I think they are already... I can't get accessories that are part of a set. Uh, yeah, the accessories are never uh, attached to any of those post-game sets. So getting this back was not what we want. Although in this case, decorative knot, or was it large grass knot or decorative knot? They are already part of the restoring the Han Empire set, so they would not, they would never come with, um, yeah, I think this is what we just got, but aspirations for restoring the Han. Yeah, so these are never going to be, uh, helping us get the crazy ass post game, uh, thingy. I'll tell you what, I'm going to call it a video, um, it's a little early, but I do want to get one more recorded and then get onto something else, so I will do that, and when we come back next time, we probably will almost certainly not be defeating Yuan Shu. Thanks for watching.